Oh, there we go. Fish on. Oh, oh, going. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that guy took off. Wow. 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 Oh shit, he took the... Oh, what? Holy crap. Oh my god. Oh, holy crap. It's like a steelhead. Yakima River, one of my favorite winter fisheries. Been a been some time, you know, it's been at least a week since I fished here. And I'm at my favorite spot, and guess what? I'm the only one here. And I hope to get into some trout today. So thanks for joining me. Let's uh let me show you what I got going on. So today I'm using two rods. I've got a five weight, and that's set up with a pink San Juan worm. It's a squirmy wormy. It's uh it almost feels like cheating, but you know what? It's an effective winter fly. And then a TJ Hooker stone fly on the new Oros indicator. Second time using these indicators, so far so good. On my second rod and down in the holster, I've got my three weight and a streamer, a great big Dalai Lama. I think that's what's in, what they call this streamer. Big, huge pattern. I might throw a sink tip on that to see if maybe I can get down a little bit further later on in the day. But anyway, Kobe should be here shortly and we're gonna fish this spot all freaking day long. And that's what you call homesteading a spot because that's what we're gonna do. All right, let's go fishing, fish on. You know what I think I'm most excited about? I'm excited about the fishing. But I'm excited about the fact that it is above freezing because the last time I was here was freaking cold. And even though, you know, I don't mind fishing in the winter, when everything is constantly icing up, it just gets to be a little bit challenging. So it's just refreshing when you don't have to fish in the icy conditions. So I'm very thankful that it's in the upper 30s right now. So about that. It's a little windy though. So that kind of that kind of makes it a little, a little tougher. Oh, already had already had a takedown. That's good though. I don't like uh, I don't like catching fish on the first cast because you know there's just that there's that superstition that goes along with. Uh, catching fish on the first cast. So let's see if we can catch this fish on the second cast. Fish on! Oh, this is a big fish. Sorry, I missed the take. I wasn't recording. Oh yeah. Oh, big head shake. Wow. This fish is, feels like it got some size to it for sure. Oh yeah. Oh, this is a pretty, pretty darn big fish. Wow, look at this guy, oh. Holy smokes. Oh, wow. That is a big fish. Holy snakies. Look at the size of that fish. Wow. Nice fish. Look at this guy. Wow. Sweet. That is a way to start off a trip to the Yakima River. This spot always holds big old slabs just like that. Let's go catch another one. Fish on. Well, guess who joined me? Goey's with me. What's up? Let's go catch a fish. <laughs> fish on. <laughs> it didn't come off, did it? My net's gone. Did it, did it come off? It's gone somewhere, yeah. I love that net, too. God. I'll check the shore. My Tartaro. But of course, I'll even net it for you. <laughs> nice, nice fish. That's quality, that's a nice fish. 
Ooh. Sweet! Okay, no skunkage. <laughs> no skunks. Oh, there we go. Fish on. Oh, oh shit, going. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that guy took off. Oh, I just want it to stay on. Please stay on. Please stay on. Wow. <laughs> wow. Wow. That's not a little fish. Jeez. Oh my God, Kobe. This is a good fish. Holy shit, he took the, oh what? Holy crap. Oh my God. Holy crap. It's like a steelhead. Oh my God. Dude, that thing is huge. It barely fits in my net. Look at this fish. I swear, this is either a very large trout or it's a steelhead. She fucking threw it out. Look at this thing. Oh, oh, oh. That's freaking huge. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, fish on. <laughs> All right, it's starting to get dark and we're going to fish for just a little bit longer, head back down to the Jeep and head home. So thanks, Kobe, for joining me. <laughs> All right, everybody, until the next time, peace on.